Am I the asshole? For outing my brother to his in-laws and kids. My parents live with me because I bought their house when they were going to lose it. They were going to lose it because of all the money they spent keeping my brother out of jail and keeping him in rehab. My brother is clean and sober now. Married, with kids. Religious. With a father-in-law that gave him a great job. He has never paid my parents back one cent. I live in the basement suite with my girlfriend and my dog. I make good money and my parents deserve to have a good life. They did what they thought was best. My brother had us all over to his house for a barbecue. It was a good meal and his kids are all right for being his offspring. He then proceeded to mock me for still living at home, smoking weed, and playing video games while living in sin. I told him to shut up and leave me out of whatever was going on. He said that he just knew I could be doing so much better if I applied myself and looked for guidance. I thanked him for the meal and my girlfriend and I went to leave. He yelled that he was just telling me what I needed to hear to motivate me. I got upset so I said I was motivated. I said that I liked to smoke weed and to drink. But that I paid for it myself with money I earned from a job. I never stole from our parents to pay for drugs. I said that I lived on the basement of a house I own because I couldn't afford two houses. One for me and one for our parents. And that since they went into debt to pay for his lawyers and rehab I was subsidizing his life. I said that my college fund went up his nose. I may be bitter. We left. I guess his wife, who knew everything, had never told her parents. My parents understand why I blew my top but they think I should have kept it in until it was only family there. I think it was nice of you to refresh your brother's memory since he basically insisted on you doing so. His past would have stayed there if he hadn't decided to call you out for taking care of the mess he made. Seriously, what did he possibly expect to gain by needling you? Not the asshole. Not the asshole. You just clarified the long journey your brother took to be doing something much better and applying himself. If his in-laws and children didn't realize the journey involved hardcore drug addiction and stints in jail and rehab, oh well, they do now. Your brother is a condescending hypocritical R. He knows exactly why you're living in the basement because of him. Was he trying to look good in front of his in-laws? He obviously doesn't understand that calling you out in front of them, even if what he said had been true, would have been an R move but even more, expecting you to take it, after everything he has done was not going to happen. Good for you. Not the asshole. Not one bit. They think I should have kept it in until it was only family there the in-laws are his family and they have a right to know the kind of person who will be raising their grandkids. Your notar, clearly. Your brother needs to drop his high and mighty act and your parents need to put him on a plan to pay them and in turn you back. You stunted your life because your brother fucked up everyone else's and every party you, your brother, and parents needs to come together and have that talk. Since he's doing so well now he can start providing for those who provided this life for him. Not the asshole. Did the drugs cause memory problems for your brother? Not the asshole. His in-laws are family. His family. If he didn't want his dirty history aired to those around him, he shouldn't have started it in front of them. Born-again religious folks are some of the worst hypocrites, and sometimes need to be reminded about where they came from. Not the asshole. Don't start nothing there won't be nothing. Not the asshole. Maybe he should have kept it in until it was only family there? Just saying? Or, maybe, if this is so important to your parents, they might want to move in with him? To enjoy him paying back, and so you could sell that house and start your own life free of family? Not the asshole he chose the place and time, he wanted you to feel humiliated in the open and among close family, he served his own meal right there. Not the asshole people who live in glass sand castles built upon the generosity of others yourself, included shouldn't throw rocks. Don't start clambering for moral high ground in the blame game unless you're ready, brother. He got what was coming to him. 
It's not your problem his in-laws didn't know. And then what happened? Not the asshole, he was criticizing you, forgetting where he was before turning over. And you are nowhere near that. If this information was not supposed to be shared with his in-laws, he should have kept his mouth shut. Not the asshole. He doesn't get to ride in on a high horse after he got high with the original horse, on horse or whatever and didn't even pay for any of it after coming back down. He needed to be confronted. That was such a horse's hind end move. Sorry for all the horse references. It just took off. Some people just need to be shaken out of their delusion and this was it. You did nothing wrong and you have nothing to apologize for to your brother or your parents or anyone else. He pressed and faffot. Hard. Not the asshole he really deserved every second of that. Not the asshole, there is a saying, the truth only hurts the ones it should. Not the asshole. So, is he going to start a repayment program to your parents? Not the asshole. Hypocrites, especially religious hypocrites, should always be exposed. Not the asshole. He made his bed so to speak. He was out of line and you defended yourself. Not the asshole. There's this cliche about glass houses that fits here. Not the asshole good for you telling him so. They think I should have kept it in until it was only family there. I disagree. You weren't the host of the dinner, nor are you the connection or invested party for the relationship with bros in laws. If he wanted to bring this topic up in front of other people, well that's on him to deal with the fallout. I hope that by calling him out in front of his extended family you've triggered him to pay back the money. Not the asshole. He was tearing you down for no reason other than to make himself look better. Now his in-laws know the truth and he can't run his high and mighty con anymore. Not the asshole. And don't apologize. Those in glass houses. I said that my college fund went up his nose. Damn, this line just hits. Harder than the high he got from the drugs Lamau. Not the asshole. Not the asshole, the only thing worse than a junkie, is a holier than thou recovering junkie. Not the asshole. He shouldn't start arguments in front of his in-laws if he doesn't want his dirty laundry aired in front of them. Not the asshole. He absolutely deserved that. Not the asshole your brother's superiority complex and attempt to shame you into whatever version of life he feels is appropriate. He wants an audience for him to show off his shiny new glass house forgetting just how unstable the foundation was. He decided to imitate this interaction, and it's no one's fault but his own that his own past secrets are now on show. He learned a valuable lesson in not being prideful. Now he's responsible for explaining his past. Bummer. He has to do what he was trying to shame inspire you to do. Turnabout is fair play. Not the asshole. Not the asshole you even tried to walk away. But he keep poking. He got what he deserved. Not the asshole. Good for you. You didn't out him, you spoke the truth.